Welcome to the Nicholas 11X12 technology. Today we're looking at the Deepcool Quanta DQ650 EVO 650 watt 80 plus gold certified power supply. Probably the ideal amount of wattage for most gaming PCs. This PSU currently costs about 100 US dollars, which isn't that much for a high quality PSU. Deepcool stands behind their product with a long 5 year warranty. Thanks a lot to Deepcool for sending me this power supply to review. In the box, the power supply itself of course, all the cables with all the connectors, the power cord, 4 nice black PSU screws and last but not least a warranty card. The Deepcool DQ650 EVO is a single rail PSU and should be able to deliver 650 watts of continuous power at a pretty high temperature of 50 degrees celsius. Also this is an 80 plus gold certified unit so efficiency is guaranteed here. To keep this PSU running cool, a 140mm PWM fan is used here and as you'd expect this of course is a unit with active PFC. The input voltage is 100 to 240 volts. As for protections we have over voltage protection OVP, under voltage protection UVP, over current protection OCP, over temperature protection OTP, short circuit protection SCP and over power protection OPP. Again, this is a single rail PSU with 54 amps on a 12 volt rail, that means 648 watts. The 3.3 and 5 volt rails both offer 20 amps and a combined power output of 100 watts. Right off the bat I just have to say it's a beautiful power supply, at least for my taste. The design is kept somewhat minimalistic, but to be honest, I shouldn't be caring too much about the aesthetics of a PSU. Still it comes with a nice golden fan grill and the Deepcool logo. The coating on the case looks very beautiful and I've seen that one already on the DQ1250 before. On the rear, as always, ventilation holes, the power input and the power switch. Now this is a semi-modular PCU, not a fully modular one, since the most important cables are still attached to the unit, which is not a big deal at all since the 24 pin and 8 pin power connectors are obligatory connectors anyways. The modular connections are color coordinated so there is no way to plug in the wrong cables, besides there is a nice legend. Now let's take a look at all the cables. First of all, all the cables are completely black and make use of that flat ribbon cable design, which I simply love to see in PCUs these days. Attached to the PCU is the 24 pin power connector and the 4 plus 4, so 8 pin ATX 12 volt CPU power connector. Included are 3 SATA slash Molex cables. Two of these have three SATA and one Molex power connector on each cable. The third cable comes with two SATA and two Molex connectors. So altogether we have eight SATA and four Molex connectors. Unfortunately no sign of a floppy power connector. Yes that connector might be old school but even certain modern components such as sound cards still require that connection. To solve this issue, Deepcool included a Molex to floppy adapter on their DQ1250 I've reviewed. But unfortunately, this is not the case here, a bit disappointing. So you'd have to buy such an adapter yourself. Then there are two PCIe cables with two PCIe 6 plus 2, so 8 pin connections. That means altogether four PCIe 6 plus 2, so 8 pin power connectors. As for the length, all these cables are fairly long, so there shouldn't be any problem. Alright, the PSU itself is fairly heavy, which often means better quality when it comes to reputable manufacturers. So let's take the cover off and see what components are used. Right off the bat, clearly this is a CWT platform and in terms of quality no complaints here, good high quality components are used. Now a short voltage test on idle I always like doing. On the 12 volt rail the multimeter shows us 12.11 volts, on the 5 volt rail 5.08 volts, very good. The Deepcool DQ650 EVO is a really good power supply for sure. It offers a good amount of wattage, is perfectly stable, not loud at all, is very efficient 80 plus gold and comes with a 5 year warranty. That means the build quality is really good too, but we've seen that ourselves already when it took off the cover. With this DQ650 EVO you could easily power up most modern gaming PCs, even Crossfire or SLI configuration should be fine. However not 3 or 4 way, I'm talking about 2 way here. I know the aesthetics don't really matter at all here in a PSU, but I just have to say I like the looks of this unit and besides, the nice black flat ribbon cables make cable management easier and look very tidy at the same time too. A good amount of power connectors is offered, so no complaints here. 
However, I would have wished to see at least a Molex to floppy adapter here, since that's what's missing here. But other than that, a very well made deep cool power supply with good performance to offer, with a reasonable price of 100 US dollars. I'd definitely recommend this deep cool Quanta DQ650 Evo 650 watt power supply. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas11x12techx.com to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.